hello friends in this video i will explain you how you can uh, simulate the face id in touch id in iphone simulators remember that you can only simulate this in uh, simulators only you can't uh, do this in uh, real iphones and also another thing that you need to remember is face id is applicable to iphone x onwards only because face id was introduced in iphone x uh, and later versions of uh, models of the iphone so we have already seen like uh, if you open the simulator and go to hardware there you can see there is a touch id and uh, there are three options enrolled matching touch non-matching touch since this iphone is iphone 8 simulator then uh, that's why it is showing touch id but uh, if you open the iphone x then there will be face id as well there so basically uh, you have to enroll it and then once the touch id or face id is enrolled you can send uh, matching and non-matching touch or face so uh, how to do this in programming in apm so for that we have got one program here you can see so this this one is for the uh, sending the face id first of all we have to enroll this uh, face id uh, so for that there is this is the execute script that you can use mobile enroll biometric is enabled true so we have enabled the biometric here and then to send the uh, matching face id you can use this particular script again execute script is used mobile send biometric match and in here we have to pass this parameter face id match and here we have passed true here we have passed false perform failing or the non-matching uh, face id authentication and uh, similarly for the touch id and there is one capability you need to remember allow touch id enroll true remember that in the face id we have not passed any capability but we have executed this script enroll biometric to register the uh, or enroll the face id and here we have passed this capability allow touch id enroll is equal to true and after that it is very simple we have to just do driver.perform touch id true driver.perform touch id false but uh, you can also do this thing in the uh, using execute script as well now if you look at this uh, simulator code you have got uh, programs for touch id and face id let us look at touch id first and you can see we have used this perform touch id the same program is there actually basically so basically this uh, this program or uh, this code is required when you want to do authentication some applications uh, might need this biometrics for example uh, if you have used uber there they use this uh, face authentication and that at that time uh, they might use this face id or touch id or there are certain applications uh, where this biometrics is heavily used in that case uh, in scenarios uh, like that we can use this uh, simulations for the face id and touch id if you are facing any issues uh, with this uh, let me know through the comments thanks for watching this video